Hey guys, how are you doing? In this episode, we are going to see how to get App Store back on iPhone home screen. The process is very much the same for both iPhone and iPad. So if you are new to iPhone or iPad, then follow these th three simple tips in order to fix the App Store not visible on your iPhone or iPad home screen or you think you have accidentally deleted App Store and you want to restore the App Store and bring it back to your home screen. The very first step you need to do is navigate to the last page of your home screen which is the App Library section. Simply tap here and search for App Store. If you have removed the App Store from the home screen, it is not possible to delete the App Store. Apple allows us to delete the stock applications and other third-party applications, but it is not possible to delete the App Store. When we try to delete it by doing the long press, you can see that the Remove App option, when you tap, it shows only Remove from Home Screen or you can cancel it. If you do it for the stock application, one of the stock application called Shortcuts, then you can see the Delete App option is there. Once you deleted it, you can download it again from App Store. So till date, you cannot delete your App Store completely from your iPhone or iPad. You will see only the remove home screen. Once you have given the remove home screen, you can easily bring it back from the app library by searching for the App Store. Simply tap and hold and drag the icon and you can, you know, place it back on the home screen wherever you want the icon to be. The process is very much same on both the iPhone and iPad. So remember this. And if you have searched the app library and still the app is not there, the second step comes into the play. Navigate to the settings and then check the screen time, which is the common solution that you must have seen with various other YouTube videos. And when you search in Google, this is the first solution that they normally suggest. So scroll to the restrictions area if the content and privacy restrictions is on and then you need to go inside the iTunes and App Store purchases. Inside you can see that installing apps permission is given in my iPhone. If I set it to don't allow then the App Store will disappear. It kind of took uh, you know a few additional seconds I have to cut and move forward because I think it is maybe the one of the iOS 18 bug. Right now I'm running the iOS 18 developer beta version and even after enabling it even if you search in app library for app store you will not be seeing that option so this is the second step you need to check your settings application and then navigate to screen time okay here the screen time and content and privacy restrictions and here you need to turn off the content and privacy restrictions or you need to navigate inside select installing apps tap on allow this brings back the app store you know in the last known uh, the home screen location and you can rearrange the icon as you wish all right you have tried both the steps and still the app store is not visible on your iphone even the settings screen time installing apps is set to allow but still you're not seeing it this is the last step you need to try. If you have installed any third party parental control applications or screen time control application, something like CAPE application, which allows you to disable the app installation, which again uses the screen time permission in order to remove the app store from your home screen of both the iPhone and iPad. Okay, it's not just the CAPE application. You can also do the same under OneSec or ScreenZen. I think OneSec has certain limitations, but similar screen time parental control applications can also remove screen to app store i'm sorry app store from your iphone or ipad so make sure to check for the third party application in your app library uh, you know so that you can search for screen normally and uh, stc is another application which you know allows you to hide the applications on your iphone or ipad and that could you know be the option you have accidentally selected the app store permission so it is completely removed from your iphone or ipad so these are the three methods that will help you to bring back the app store on your iphone or ipad home screen i hope these tips helped you to fix the issue for more useful iphone ipad and mac related tips and tricks don't forget to subscribe thank you and have a wonderful day